Okay, guys, if you thought even for a second that Wargaming is going to let you live with your huge piles of gold, uh, what you were able to get after spending hundreds and thousands and billions of euros, uh, dollars, yenis on the loot boxes, well, you are so very wrong, because today they released an article about upcoming uh, kind of a mini black market event uh, uh, auction, official auction system over here. Article titled Under the Hammer. Place your beats, commanders, from January 14th, so in five days, until January 19th, you will have a chance to receive very rare vehicles for gold and for free experience. I, be I believe this is the first time ever you are able to get special vehicles uh, for free experience. Because, uh, you know, they have never done that. At least I do not remember any events like this before. For this, you will need to make a bid at a special auction and win. Over a period of five days, the auction will sell several exclusive vehicles and they can be all yours if you pay hardcore enough. Now, this is all. They're going to say um, in this article and over here we have a 40 second teaser actually about this event and uh, community has done a lot of digging already. What Express uh, Reddit um, has done a lot of digging already trying to basically solve the uh, easter eggs behind it. But at first let's take a look at this teaser together and then let's analyze it a bit. This trailer is basically filled with easter eggs. Only. It's basically like only easter egg trailer. January 14th until January 19th, and this is basically it. Uh, this is the entire teaser, 32 second long teaser, what we can see over here. But now, let's talk about some of the easter eggs about this event. Um, what community has already kind of deciphered or uh, however you crack the gold, however you call it. Uh, this one over here is quite a big hint uh, and I would say those two go together. So it lasts for five days and over here you can see lot number five, you know, one, two, three, four, five. So we are going to have five different auctions. Here is the price and here are the emblems, uh, free experience emblem and gold emblem. So uh, two different currencies, as they said, free experience and gold. And uh, you can see one, two, three, four, five lots, uh, five different vehicles, five days. And over here, this uh, most likely hints towards uh, the tears we are going to get. So, uh, first auction is going to be for tier 10 vehicle, most likely. Well, of course, guys, keep in mind, everything over here is unofficial. They have not officially said anything. This is what community has uh, been thinking and uh, uh, kind of trying to crack everything over here. This is just what we think, basically, uh, is going to happen. So first is going to be tier 10 vehicle, then a second one tier 8 auction, tier 10 auction, fourth one tier 8 auction, and the final fifth one is once again going to be a tier 10 auction. Now, moving on with the hints, ladies and gentlemen, over here, they basically uh, hinted towards the lots and uh, whatnot. The next table is going to be... Uh, on the next table, there are going to be clear hints towards um, upcoming vehicles. And this one over here is very freaking interesting. And if you connect all the dots, um, well, I believe it is quite safe for now to say that it is going to be the one and only object uh, 268 version 5. Not version 4, version 5. Tank which I covered on this channel roughly one or two weeks ago. Uh, very freshly covered this vehicle. Here is how it looks. It is the uh, turret uh, Soviet Russian tank destroyer. You can see it has the uh, version 4 uh, style of uh, commander hand shown it up over here as well. Uh, kind of, you know, heavy tank, tank destroyer-ish vehicle. And uh, they did not do anything to this vehicle for exactly, almost exactly one year. Last time I covered uh, Object uh, 268 version 4 was at the end of 2020. And... Uh, the next time I covered it was at the end of 2021, so roughly two weeks ago or something like that. They buffed it, 
And now it is over here and why it is quite a clear hint towards this vehicle. It looks like a heavy tank, right? But it is actually a tank destroyer. Object 268 version 5. Let's take a look at this number again. Object 268 version 5. 268 divided by 5, ladies and gentlemen, is 53.6. This number exactly over here. And this triangle over here, isn't that a tank destroyer logo, a tank destroyer emblem, usually for tank destroyers? Triangle? It pretty much is. So this is what community thinks is going to be uh, the first auction or at least part of the auction system, if not, uh, if, if not uh, like the first one, right? Second hint, binoculars. Now this can hint towards two different things. It can hint towards uh, a uh, light tank, scouting tank, what we have not seen on sale for a very long time, for example, EBR-75, because uh, they hinted towards a tier 8 vehicle as well, uh, under the hammer, you know, uh, the hammer pad or however you call it. Um, so it might be a light tank, hinting towards a light tank, or alternatively, this is the binocular what people use in Oprahs, for example. And this one is, uh, well, if it is going to be Oprah, well, we actually have a vehicle called Opera in the game. 113113 Beijing Opera with a special, this is basically, basically like 113, we have no, absolutely no models over here, no visual, no live models over here, but it is 113 with the special Opera skin. I'm going to show you some uh, uh, print screens on the background at least, so you can get an idea how this vehicle uh, might look like. and. Um, it's either a light tank, I would uh, I would guess EBR-75, because it is kind of a rare vehicle, what they do not sell super often, and you know, on the borderline being OP, and uh, they want to con kind of control the sale, you know, the more hype a vehicle gets, the less they want to release it right away. Uh, this is just the standard marketing over here, or this Opera, uh, Beijing Opera, might be a thing because of a tier uh, 10. We have three tier 10s to figure out and two tier 8s, most likely. Uh, moving on, uh, next one, uh, they, they stop over here, envelope, uh, I honestly have to say I have no idea what is, uh, what is hints the words, maybe com something completely new, still hidden, uh, a completely new tier 8 vehicle, we'll see. I don't know. If you have any ideas, please let me know. Maybe this uh, says something to you. Comment section is for that because we're trying to predict the stuff over here beforehand. The next one, this one as well. Uh, I heard uh, uh, from Reddit that his uh, style of book plus bunny plus pocket watch, uh, it uh, hints the words uh, like some kind of... Um, uh, how to say that? Uh, who writes books? Writer, right? This all, all this, uh, this full combo hints towards a writer, but I'm not sure. I don't know about that, and I do not want to. If I don't know stuff, you know, I'm going to say it out loud. I don't want to uh, make up things. So once again, if you have idea what this combo uh, might uh, feel like, uh, or you know, hint towards, please let me know in the comment section. And finally. Uh, we have this egg over here. Now, there are two ways how to look at this egg. It might be hinting towards this thing over here, killing, uh, you know, chilling, wz one or one jilling, uh, which uh, they released in the black market for absolutely ridiculous price. There was a Russian streamer, I remember, who spent 100 million credits only on this vehicle in the black market. But people are saying it might hint towards that because of the style, black and gold, but at the same time it was made by the Russian family, hinting towards Russian. Uh, maybe a Russian vehicle, you know, there are a couple different ways how to look at his hint right over here. What do you think, guys? What would you like to see it? Honestly speaking, if it is Jillin, I am not as excited as I would be about something else. Uh, like, uh, you know, community has uh, made fun of this, <laughs> like this vehicle on the uh, Bot Express, for example, that it is going to be one of the golden tanks. Uh, it is, you know, even more OP than 279E uh, is uh, like 10 times more OP, right? 
uh, surviving multiple nuclear blasts and whatnot. Uh, but uh, the list over here so far, so Object 268 version 5, all the stars are aligned, all the dots are connecting that it might be over here. Them buffing it just recently as well. Then the Oprah or EBR and the two completely new vehicles maybe. Uh, book with a hair on a bookmark, you know, just something let's see let's quickly let me quickly refresh this site uh, do we have any more information no we don't do not have any uh, newer information about that so ladies and gentlemen we'll uh, see let's translate uh, Lorna dream hard Lorna the third degree binoculars Possibly a reference to the opera. Okay, yeah, this is this is talking about that. So, ladies and gentlemen, please let me know what you think about that. Uh, to you, do you want to see another black market event? Uh, what what are your predictions and so on? And by the way, guys, on the screen right now, boom, just like that, I have all the winners from the uh, 200 large uh, Christmas boxes, 320 euros worth of Christmas boxes um, on the screen. All the winners are on the screen. Uh, emails. Uh, recognizable emails I have been able to contact get into contact with most of you guys so if you see your email over here and if you have not answered back to me uh, please do that ASAP because I would like to send out some boxes so basically I asked which collection needs the most help because every single winner got 25 boxes so uh, 320 euros worth in total congratulations to all of you guys stay tuned for many more giveaways 2022 is going to be absolutely massive year over here I love you all stay awesome stay sexy take care and a bye.